hey guys welcome back to my channel how are you guys doing from the title you guys could see we're trying to become more of a morning person for 2022 this is a struggle of mine it's always going to be a struggle my alarm just went off it is 4 45 in the morning and i'm trying to get to the gym by five the struggle is real like I just can't function in the mornings I can function afternoons but I want to be more productive with my days um, and not rush and become more overwhelmed as the day ends so I decided to get up at 5 in the morning or rather 4 45 so I could be at the gym at 5 as you can see I am struggling to get out of bed you hear me I am struggling because it is too early for anyone to be up I don't know how some people do it it's just not my thing So guys, the first thing I'm going to do once I get out of bed is go to the bathroom and wash my face so I can wake up some. And then I am going to brush my teeth and get dressed and head on out to the gym. guys once i am done brushing my teeth washing my face and getting dressed i'm gonna tiptoe downstairs because everyone else is sleeping and um sit on these stairs and get my shoes on for us to go through the door Guys, once I am done with that, I'm gonna go into the kitchen and get my water canister so I can stay hydrated in the gym. I go in between water and um, Gatorade, and today I'm using water. Fill my canister up, and I'm gonna grab my coat, and we're off to the gym. I'm looking back behind me to see if anyone else is up, which you're not. Guys, once I get to the gym, I normally do 30 minutes of cardio. And my cardio normally consists of the Stairmaster. I'm cleaning it down before I get started. And then I'm just going to get straight into my workout because this right here is a beast. I do 30 minutes um, between 5 and 10 are my levels, depending on how tired I get. Um, I just go harder in here it gets my blood flowing and my body going to get into my workouts so i love doing the stair masters this is a must
guys it is legs day so i'm going to use this machine right here to get my legs started it really gives me a burn but yeah it be hurting i can't walk when i'm done using this but i love it but i hate it at the same time We're doing three sets of 15. Double leg, single leg, and then single leg. This right here, I used to be intimidated of it because I didn't know how to use it, but once I learned how to use it, it's my absolute favorite machine. If I could use this every day, I will definitely use it every day. Um, it's always packed on one this side. The guys just hound it but guys i am back home and first thing i'm gonna do once i get home is wash my hand and get my protein shake going and i normally use well that's the only thing i actually use is herbal life um i've been using it for the past three or four years and I recently also added collagen to my um, protein shake just for a little boost it's also good for your skin so I'm adding my ice some water and then I use two scoops of each the white one and the black container and then one scoop of collagen Guys, the struggle is real. I couldn't figure out how to close it. It's morning, I'm telling you. I'm gonna make sure everything is blended equally. Sometimes I have some excess powder. I'm gonna pluck that out. I'm gonna head on upstairs, take me a shower, and get my day started. Guys, after my shower, I'm gonna come down. I'm gonna sit in my office. Um, and this will just get me started in terms of I need if there's any emails or anything that I need to get done on my computer. First, I'm going to check my Instagram and see who's up and who's posting and try to keep up to date. <laughs> we all do this since I haven't like really been on my phone because I was working out. I just want to, you know, go through it a little bit. I am looking at this while I'm talking to you guys and I didn't realize that my clock over my desk... <laughs> Is not working properly yeah the battery ran out so i need to fix that but yeah guys now i'm going through my emails um and checking anything that i might have missed while i was asleep or when i went out to the gym um this i find that this has helped me a lot um you know just getting up early i'm being more productive with my day i'm not rushing at the end of the day if i get up at 4 30 or even 5 and i work till 2 30 3 30 um i'm getting in eight hours of work I'm, I'm doing eight hours worth of things that if i start my day at, at 10 11 it's I feel like I'm rushing because I gotta get a money, I gotta get a ride, I gotta make sure dinner is ready, and you know, stuff like that. So, you know, getting up at five gets the momentum going and it keeps me going throughout the day. I'm like constantly on the go. So, here you can see I'm writing in my notebook the stuff that I wanna get accomplished today or things that I need to get done within the next couple of days or a few weeks or maybe even a month. In this book, I also write down the stuff that I want to accomplish for the year. So it keeps me on track, keep me grounded, and keep me going on what I want.
trying to accomplish or what I'm trying to accomplish and yeah this is what I do and I and it's now like around 6 30 7 45 and I'm just literally waiting for Araya to wake up so I could take her to school and you know get going on the road as you can see this right here I'm about to play a game it is my favorite relaxing thing to do my husband say I am obsessed which I am but it, it keeps my mind going but um yeah guys this is my morning routine how to stay productive how to be more of a morning person for 2022 you don't necessarily have to do this you could add your own thing to it you don't have to get up at five you could get up at six or seven whichever floats your boat but 